I've always wondered this. How does a restaurant get a James Beard Award? What has to happen? Is there like, you're nominated? Okay, they have to come? There's a committee. Or they so get there's, invited? Well, there's different, there, so there's different um, categories within the James Beard Foundation. The award that we received is the American Classics Award. So it's very different than for the, everything is Best Chef, North, Best Chef North, Best Chef West, Best Evil Chef North, Best Evil Chef Choice, Quiz mm-hmm. Power Program, Best Design of the Year. So it's, there's some, and that's, you know, okay. it's so different. It's like the Oscars, Best yes. Picture, Best Act, blah, blah, blah. But then you get, you get these American classics that they're not nominated. You just walk in as a winner. Like you're the only one that walks in knowing like you've already won. Wow. Everyone else walks in knowing that they're nominated and they may win, they may not win. You don't understand. Wow. The American Classics is, is based, there's a committee. They, and it's huge. I mean, this, they're, they're members from all over the country. And everyone submits uh, who they think would be a great American Classics recipient. Got wow. it. Okay. And it so happens that whatever happened that year, a lot of people agreed that we were one of the restaurants. And got a phone call. It was a voicemail and I started listening to it and I was going to be like, <laughs> and I thought they were trying to sell me advertising for, for, for the yeah, yeah, James yeah. Beard. That's I funny. honestly, when I, I was like, I don't know, I think they're trying to sell me something. And, and they told you, you, you want it. The message was nothing that I wanted. The message was saying about the James Beard, blah, blah, blah. And I wasn't even called back. I was like, this is what trying to sell me advertising <laughs> or they want me to like buy something or, you know, Yeah. I mean, Listen, when you own a business, it's very seldom people ask you to give you something. Mm-hmm. Right. When you own a business, everyone calls you because they have a problem for you to resolve or they want something from you or they're trying to sell you something. Yeah. Like, every time my phone rings, it's one of those three things. Yeah. So then does the committee come? Or? So then they, so then I get a phone call and, and I call back. And I was like, hey, I'm returning a phone call. And it was like, so you won this. Oh, wow. That, or I was like, excuse me? Wait, I'm so confused right now. And <laughs> they just kept going and I'm like, and they told me the only thing is that we ask that you don't say anything because um, this was in December. Okay. And they told me we cannot announce until March. So you know, one you had to keep it a secret. Yeah, we cannot. We cannot tell anyone. It's just completely like you know confidential. We can't allow any of this news to happen until the wow. foundation releases every all the nominees and they release the the recipients for the. You know, that time when I just broke down crying, my brother was in the room. I was like, oh my God. This is all, I mean, this is kind of one of those awards that I thought they were so far out of reach for me. Yeah. Because I'm not a new restaurant. When you win as a, a new chef, it's it's very different. They're basically giving it to someone who went to school for right. culinary. Right. You know, they have a new restaurant. They, they weren't apprenticed to some big name. Right. Yeah. You yeah. know, it's, it's one of these things that as a restaurateur, you know, design or you know you have to hire a great designer i mean there's these these awards are not for restaurants like us i didn't think wow so i i never even i thought it was so far-fetched but i always had it and you know my vision board of like one day one day what did your parents think i mean they left you with this restaurant i didn't even know what that was (laughs) (laughs) who's hummus no no he didn't know i was like yeah and he was like okay good for you guys like i don't know what to you know he had no idea (laughs) He didn't know what it was until we actually got to Chicago. Check this out. And then they told us what day the, the, the award, award ceremony. ceremony was in in May, I think. Like, oh, okay. wow. April or like. So they announced in March. Like, yeah, like first week of May. And then I was pregnant when they gave me the, <laughs> the, when I was pregnant when they gave me the news. Oh, my goodness. And then once I do my calculations, I was like, hold on a second. I was like, oh, my God, I'm going to have a 60 gold. At the time, you yeah. get the award. Wow. Oh, I'm gonna have, my kids are going to be either four weeks or six <laughs> weeks. Yeah, because you like, didn't know yet. I didn't know what time. I mean, my, my due date was April 4th, so the awards were, I think, were the first week of May. So I thought my son was going to be three to four weeks. I just prayed to God. I was like, oh, my God. That's I, tough. You know, what am I going to do? Because, you know, in, in Latino world, you really cannot do anything <laughs> Latino world. until your kid's six weeks. No, my mom would kill me. Like, I, right. I take a trip to Target once and she almost, like, oh my she God. speak to me for, like, a day. <laughs> your first 40 days are the most sacred days you could have. You cannot put your body through anything. You cannot do anything the first 40 days. Wow. I turned 40 days a day we flew out. Wow. Oh, my goodness. Uh, That's so amazing. My son stayed behind with my husband. My husband didn't go to work show uh, and his mom. Um, for that weekend and mom got turned 
for sure. <laughs> I, haven't, I haven't had a sip of drink since, you know, two years ago. Yeah. And your whole family's with you, right? Oh, your dad, your mom, was, siblings. My parents and my three siblings, the, the six of us went in Chicago. Oh, that's amazing. It was so much fun. We went to dinner. And I think it wasn't until we were in Chicago that my dad realized. This is a big deal. And he was like, why am I going to have to get a tuxedo? I'm like, because <laughs> this is a big deal. <laughs> He's like, Okay. And is it like an award ceremony where oh, you're yeah, all like sitting? Okay. Yeah, so how's the food? Well, there's, there's actually seating. It's actually stadium seating. Okay. Afterwards, they open food for everyone. Like a caterer stations. style? No, okay. stations. Okay. Like, like a food fest. Okay. But it's the, and there's like, man. like it All is the a, chefs. Well, not just all the chefs, but all the champagne, all the wine, all the food, all the caviar, everything that you can Amazing. think of. Oh, beautiful. Like you turn left, right, and like you turn left, and like Costa Andres is there. You turn left, and like Wolfgang well, Cup Puck is there. Wow. You walk, and you're like, hey, Nancy. Hey, what's up, guys? Nancy wow. Silverton. I mean, like everyone, oh. everyone is there. That's everyone amazing. Is. And then, you know, we had one, so we were, you know, popular, and it was like the most, and my dad had to, had to get so drunk because he was so nervous because he didn't realize, oh. like, how big of a deal it was. He was, like, shaking, <laughs> and he went up on stage because he's, like, he told us, I don't want to go up on stage. Why do I have to go up on stage? Like, that's not my restaurant anymore. Yeah. But he, it was so important for us that he received it with my yeah. mom. Sure. And he gave his, um, his speech in Spanish. Oh, amazing. It was, like, the first Spanish, you know speech that was ever given on stage wow was like, what a great political statement we were like no yo you just know how to speak english like, he, <laughs> he didn't choose this he, he didn't choose it on purpose it was, it was a choice it is amazing though yeah. nonetheless yeah so it, was, it was really it was it was amazing to to go through that with my parents and and then my brother lost wow. the medal that night oh really <laughs> you don't have it or did you well, they, sent <laughs> they sent a new one wow <laughs> that's funny someone out there has a medal with them. Working like it's out <laughs> yeah. in the back.